Hello, welcome to the clinic. So today I'm going to be doing a detailed face and neck examination for you with magnification and illumination. I've also divided the face up into different zones as shown here. Okay, so starting in zone one, the forehead, left side. I'm first going to apply some magnification. I'm going to be looking first for any lumps or bumps. Okay, so I have a double source of magnification. Is the light source. So left side of the forehead, just relax. Okay, no signs of any lumps or bumps. Or nevi there. That's good. Just arc around a little. Up to the scalp line. Ah, the skin looks healthy. Let's come closer. Good. Let's go to zone 3, which is the right side of the forehead. Okay, looking for the same thing. Lumps or bumps. Any discoloration or areas of elevation, pigmentation, moles, tags, nevi, things like this. Scalp line looking fine. Healthy on the right, too. I'm going to just have a feel of the forehead with the back of each hand here. And just checking for any ipsilateral sweating there. That's fine, let's just try a little sensation test on the forehead. Close the eyes, there's a soft and slightly sharp applicator. Tell me what you feel. That's fine. Just relax. Let's take some written notes there. Okay, let me have a little look at the nose and a little feel. Lean back for me, I want to look inside the nostril slightly. Good. And for the left. That's looking clear. 
No signs of any polyps there. Just a space between the eyes. That's fine. Let's have a look at the right ear. Just turn slightly to the left, please. going to look at all the different structures of the ear, including behind the ear. Okay. Just going to have a little feel of the ear. No tenderness there. Okay, just turn slightly to your right. Look at the left ear. Any problems with your hearing at all? It's just a little bit of scarring just on the outer part of the ear canal there. Okay, let me check for any lesions. I'm going to have a feel of the ear. Just report any tenderness to me. Have a deeper look inside the ear canal with the otoscope. Right. Deep into the canals, looking wide. And many membrane. Internally fine, just the external changes there. Thank you. Just a little bit of scarring on the entrance to the ear canal on the left side. Any accidents that you know about that led to this scarring? Okay, I'll just take some notes. We're going to focus on the orbits now, the areas around the eyes skin, the eyelids, not so much the the eyeballs themselves but just the skin. Looking again for any lumps or bumps and anything sinister like carcinomas. Okay, and just look straight towards me please. Now look down, this is for the right upper lid. Skin region is clear, there's no signs of xanthalasma, no evidence of milia. Good. Okay, I'm just looking at the lashes. Evidence of uh, metrosis there. Just looking up for me, please. Let's have a look at the lower lid. I've got no polyosis. Lashes are pointing outwards nicely. Good. Okay, look 
looking more closely at the lid margins just want to ensure there's no signs of carcinoma which is very serious ok take a blink nice movement of the lid there good no signs of any chalazians so bumps close the eye let me have a little feel of the lid keep the eye closed let's try the lower lid nice and flat there okay left eye now please oh, left orbital region Close the eye to look at the upper lid. Look straight ahead. Compare the two. No signs of any tosis. Looking up now, lower lid margin. No evidence of blepharospasm at the moment. Okay, no xanthelasma, which is a good sign. No milia. Obvious cysts manifesting there. Close the eye. So feel of the upper lid there. And the lower. Just look at me straight ahead now. Look up. Equal looking apertures there. Thank you. Good looking orbital regions. No pathology identified there. So right orbit, no tosis, no evidence of xanthelasma, milia or carcinomas. No trichiasis. Just a little check of the cheek areas now, then we'll do a little sensation test again. Our right side. And left side. Again, just a sensation test. Say if you feel the sharp or soft feeling. Close the eyes, please. That's fine, you can relax now. On to the lower jaw. Any pain on chewing? No jaw pain? Not more on one side. Okay, on lower jaw, just check the skin. Okay, open the mouth wide now please, and grit the teeth, and give me a smile, move the jaw to the right, and to the left, good, relax, open the mouth wide again. Okay, and just clench the jaw please, excellent. Okay, it's just the neck region to go. Let's take some notes there. Sensation test. Around the cheeks was fine. Okay, 
Okay, let me have a grouse look at your neck. Fail of the neck, tilt your head back just ever so slightly. Okay, no problem swallowing food. my fingers just on the neck there. Okay, I just want you to swallow for me. Excellent, thank you. Have a look at that area. A little bit more detail, glass her up. Marvellous, thank you. I think overall everything's coming back fine. Wrapping up the final notes with the neck there. Just that slight scarring on the left ear. Other than that, the face examination has been fine. No abnormalities detected. Right, so that's everything. I'm going to let you go now, thank you.